Hello, anybody. I am Alpaca Patrol, and this is Europa Universalis 4. That's right. I'm back to another episode of Europa Universalis 4. Holy cow! We're back! So, we have a negative 138 gold per... Not negative 138 gold per month. That would be awful. Our manpower is okay. Our prestige is great. Uh, our legitimacy ain't great. And our stability also isn't isn't great. So, uh, in the last episode, we fought some pirates with uh, Oali Suleiman, the greatest explorer the world's ever known. Uh, of course, Oali Su Suleiman, I mean, clearly... Uh, he's the best. Uh, we're actually going to actually move Owali Suleiman up over here, and then he's going to repair there. Uh, and then these guys are just chilling, I suppose. These are just my armies. You know what I learned is you actually have, you can have control groups in this game. I was not aware of this. So, a couple things I wanted to do, I realized, since the last episode. So, our, uh, our capital is here in Gao. And see, that seems kind of lame to me. Because, what are we doing? Oh, we're gonna get an Earth Rampart. Okay, so our, our capital is here, in Gao. Okay, uh, and its trade power is 1.2, trade value 2.07, which isn't that great. This, however, has trade power 8.3, trade val value 2.02. .02. The goods produced aren't amazing. Uh, but it's still pretty good. I think this should be... Our capital. Also, we're getting like 93% of the ducats here. So I think I'm going to move our capital down to the Gold Coast. Um, also, since it's it's like an important center of trade in this uh, in this node. See, it's an important center of trade, plus 5. Um, and actually, I don't know if Gao is an important center of trade. No, it's not. So we're going to go ahead and move our capital down here to the Gold Coast. Uh, it's going to cost us 200 admin power. But that's fine. We have to be behind... On, uh, on tech anyway as we get into things. Um, another thing is I wanted to look at my fleet. So I have five heavy ships, four light ships. Oh, whoops a daisy. Oh, that's kind of cool. I actually didn't know that you could separate them out like that. Uh, so they're going to be doing their thing. Um, Owali Suleiman's going to do his thing. And essentially, we're going to work on the colonization process, and we're going to work on slowly just getting our stability up, because being able to westernize... Oh, that was a weird uh, frame rate lag. Being able to westernize is is going to be very difficult. I, I'm just going to say that right now. I it, it, it is a three stability drop, and then rebellions are going to happen, and all this awful shit's going to happen. So we're going to focus on colonization, and perhaps we're going to focus on colonization in the new world, which might be pretty cool. Uh, maybe. What do we have disputed succession on? Congo. Really? Interesting. Uh, who becomes the king? A Congolese noble. But he's only 26. Alright. Well, I mean, if he stays... If he gets, like, real old, then we might get a royal marriage and claim the throne. We are at maximum numbers of diplomatic relations. Also, I was kind of dumb last time. I was like, Oh, I can't get a royal marriage, so I can't annex these guys. Uh, that is not true. I can annex... You don't need a royal marriage to annex. Uh, because I forgot that you you don't uh, need that. So, uh, we're going to be doing that thing. What are our diplomats doing? You're free? Why don't you go ahead? Actually, when can I uh, annex? Oh, I can annex right now? Wait, no. No way. No way I can annex right now. Oh, yeah. 1520. Oh, February 1526. Excellent. When can I annex you guys? Um, annexation... Uh, how do we... Alright, fine, fuck it. We're just, we're just gonna improve relations anyway. Uh, where is that? I've been, I've been messing around with the Better UI mod, too. I think I might use that in this series. Uh, and we still have negative one on that, so we're really only making two per month, which is bad. So we might actually want to fire this guy. Uh, the diplomatic reputation's pretty nice, but I think... We're going to hire one of these guys, which eh, increases our national manpower. Sure. We need to replenish it anyway. And I, I think that's better. And we should just begin. And uh, Uwale Suleiman. Oh, royal marriage offer from Benin. Native uprising. Okay, we lost the effect trading in slaves. That kind of sucks. Uh, but not the biggest thing in the world. Also, you're not protecting trade, and you really should be. Um, and now that our capital is here in the Gold Coast, and we have an important center of trade here... Uh, we should be making a lot more money, which is awesome. Also, we should probably lower our army maintenance a bit. We have to get a little bit more things going. 
Trading in slaves happened to us, which is great. We have global tariffs increased. Uh, and then once Soali Suleiman is done, which should be this next coming month, glorious will be gloriousness will be unto us, the great and noble uh, empire of amazingness. What are we spending all of our money on? Army maintenance. Jeez. Okay, so that's done. We're gonna we're gonna explore, man. We're gonna use we're gonna do some exploration with Wali Suleiman. The greatest warrior the world's ever known. You know, here's the thing. We could potentially fire Kalabi Fatimi, but he, or Kalabi Fatim, but he's really good. And I would love to keep him. And I don't know how old he is. All right. Keep going, fellas. 5% per month, 7% per month. Ugh. We just have to keep an eye on this. We're going to keep this bad boy going. Hey, Fez is now considered part of our patrimony. Excellent. Core construction almost done. Hey, we found the new world! Holy cow, look at that! That's amazing! There is Brazil. Uh Yeah, so we yeah, we can actually we can we can colonize that if we want to. Uh though I don't know if we want to. Hey! Our colony in the Grain Coast has become self-sustaining. Now that is excellent news. Uh, so it's trading in slaves, which is great, and it's in the. It's not really okay. Let's put this back here. It's not great. Don't get me wrong. It ain't that great that we're trading in slaves. But I just want to say that the. Why is this a thing? That's kind of weird. Whatever. We're gonna build a bark because we need another one, or I could use another one. I'll say that. Um, so we have Pike Infantry and Hussar is amazing. Um, I do kind of want to build the embassy. It costs a thousand gold, but I think it's still worth it. You guys can come up here, and our merchant, or our colonist, yeah, our colonist is free, good. Okay, and away we go. Meanwhile, we're still exploring the new world. And uh, we're still looking good, we're at 100% health on that. I'm going to actually set that to control one. And if I, yeah, I can look at that, that is excellent. Uh, okay, so now he's taking some damage. Let's uh, let's get him back down over here, into there, uh, and then you guys can be control two. I'm really happy about these control groups. These are these are pretty cool, man. These are pretty cool. Okay, so we'll begin our next colonization process right around now, which is good, excellent. You guys are at 71%, so they're still pretty good. Awali Suleiman, gain five prestige, awesome, sure. I hope our legitimacy is going up. Mm, no, it's going down because of the regency, which is kind of unfortunate. Can we go over here? Ah, we can, actually. There's another tr this season. Whoa, no, 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 we're returning home. We're actually returning home. Get home, friends. Holy shit. Oh, we might lose Awali Suleiman. No! I love you, Awali Suleiman. Go survive. Oh, no, this month he's dead. Oh, he got back. What a, what a champ. Wally Suleiman, the greatest, the greatest leader the world's ever known. Why are we at such low shit? You know what? I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it up. Ah, good. We got fortified Gao, so now we could get a new mission, uh, which could be colonize the Cape. I don't know if I should. I could colonize the New World, which actually would uh, give us some, some stuff that would give us some. Uh, some things. Uh, no mission selected. National decisions available. Right, encourage divination. That's not cool. Okay, improved defenses in Fez, which is have a star fort in Fez. How expensive is a star fort? 76 gold, 10 military. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, we could do that. Sure. And what do we get from it? Five army tradition. Eh. Ooh, settler, uh, settler chance. Conquer Kano. Where is that? Uh, Kano. Oh, Kano's over here. All right, you know what? Let's uh, let's improve defenses in Fez because it's you know a nice easy easy win, and and who cares? You know, we'll uh, we'll get some things. Uh, where do we go to build a building? Uh, not a farm estate. Wait, what is this? Province farm estate. Oh, is that uh, one of the unique buildings? Interesting. Hmm. Okay, but uh, Starford is what we want to build, so let's do it. Cost 76 ducats. Yeah, okay. Alright, 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 alright. Feel pretty good. Still two of one leaders. At least we're gaining some military power per month. These guys are healing up, which is excellent. Um, 
I might want to, you know... Oh, good. Mercy is a core now, which is amazing. That is just great news. And so that means our core construction is basically done. And here we could probably... Yeah, let's recall a diplomat. And then begin the annexation process, because it seems like we can do it already. Which is amazing to me. Oh, good. The other core is done. 23 days until we get the next thing. That's great. How are you doing? Wait, no. What? What? It okay, wait. Hold on. I was trying to use my, my control group, but it seems like it doesn't work. A little bit weird. Send in the cavalry. In the times of Alexander the Great, our horsemen had the skill and the ability to be ultimate armor decision. These latter-day companions are the cream of the army, and they are always ready to go on the attack. They take pride in this and reveling in the attention they get. They seem to be. I gain cavalry combat ability until 1532. Nice. That's pretty baller. I'm not against that. Uh, harsh treatment is being done there. That's good. Um, and our diplomat's almost done. So why can't I... Oh, so I can. Okay, that's just weird, man. It's real weird. Alright, anyway, let's begin this annexation process. Yes, please. Okay, and you guys, you're at 77. It's unfortunate. It's okay. Do we have enough money? We do have uh, probably enough money to float two colonies. Question is, do we want to right now? And the answer is yes. That is the answer to this question. We want to flute. Flute. We would like to flute to Kalanese. Uh, okay, cool. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care about these ungrateful natives. We should be able to stop them pretty easily. Suffered casualties. That's okay. We're regaining. And how are you doing? 90%. So he can almost go back to exploration soon, which I'll be pretty happy about. Morocco. Hey, we're going to get the Canarius. I totally forgot about that. That's going to be awesome, actually. And you guys can come back out. Go explore down here. Whoa. Weird lag again. I don't know what the deal is with that. It's very strange. I, I do wish that you could, um, that you could set people to, like, auto-explore or something. That would be kind of nice. Okay, so they're taking some serious damage. Um, but I think we'll be okay. You guys are fine. Let's send in the colonists. Uh, probably get these guys to join up with the fleet. Where are you guys gonna be? Okay, you guys come on down here. Still at 95, so that's good at least. Uh, cool, and you guys could go ahead and protect trade. Um, now here's another thing that I could potentially do, which is, um... I could change my merchant out, because I have a merchant here in the Mauritanian coast, which, uh, yeah. We, we have, we have stuff in the other thing. Uh, we have stuff, we have, we have provinces in Sevilla, and being able to get money out of there might be a good idea. Um... Let's see, what's our trade right now? 5.47. Let's see if we can get trade from here. Mauritanian ghost guy. Mar Mauritanian ghost guy. And what, what was it? It was at, uh, we were at 5? Five, 5 something from trade? Okay. Uh, and we're still looking good. Still exploring South America. Which is awesome. We can, uh, get a new thing. Which is, uh, global tariffs plus 20%. Right, we don't really want that. Although, we get one more thing, which is production efficiency plus 10. Which might not be bad. Although, we could get the manpower modifier, which might be better. Because hmm. the tariffs, I don't really need. And the diplomatic tech, we get colonial range, naval maintenance... Oh, we get new things. All right, yeah, we're we're, we're gonna we're gonna go for the new tech, honestly. I think that's probably better. All right, Awali Suleiman, serious master of discovery and disaster. Oh, excellent! We completed that. Fortify Calabar. What do you guys want me to build? Earth Rampart. Fourteen manpower in in Calabar. Fine. I'll fortify all these places. You just watch. Just watch me fortify him. Boom. Earth Rampart. Okay. He can't go down there? That's weird. I guess he can go over here. I 
Okay, so we're at 12% attrition, so we should probably head back home after he explores there. Yeah, which he did. We can't send a colonist there. And we're still making some money. Not a great deal of money, but we're making money. And we're colonizing two places, which is awesome. Our regency's probably almost done as well. How old is our dude? Okay, never mind. He's only seven. So that's okay. How are you guys doing? 99. When's this? How long is this annexation going? 4.1. Uh. Huh. Interesting. So I guess keeping the colonists gives you an increased chance of doing things. So Congo's still a thing. I don't really have to worry about that. Annexation process is going to be done 1549. A very long time, but that's okay. I'd say okay. We could, if we make some more money, get an embassy. And if we get an embassy, that's an extra diplomat. So that is glorious. Also, goods produced. That seems real good. Um... We get goods produced here. Increases, we'll increase trade value. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, we're doing that. Also, we should check what our trade is at now. Yeah, we do less trade here with Sevilla. Unfortunately, we do. Just because we probably don't have that much trade power here. Okay, we're going to recall Merchant. We're going to send him to go down there once he's done in 40 days. Also, how are you doing? Almost back. Almost back to full. Okay. Arguin natives. Whoa! Oh, okay. I've, I've been scared me. I thought that we had no men there. I was very wrong, though. So, that's just fine. Alright. Here, we will go ahead and collect from trade with this Savian guy. You know, collect from this Mauritanian coast. Although, we don't really have that many provinces there. Trade value in node. Yeah, there's more trade value there. Lose 10 prestige or lose 50 admin power? Probably the prestige, honestly. Yeah. Unfortunately, we're going for the prestige. Um, I guess, you know, you could come back up over here, buddy. Actually, over there. Yeah. Alright. Awali Suleiman, returning to sea to, uh, to find out... What's out there? Find out the world. He's already lost shit. He's losing a lot already. For some reason. It's hardcore. I guess he must have went right through a trade wind or something. Which is a little bit dangerous, you know? Just, just a bit. Just a tad bit dangerous. But I think he'll be fine. Owali Suleiman. Exploring the new world. All these places are amazing. Uh, and greatness shall abound. His name shall be, will ring through the halls of ever time. Okay, we have a new decision to take. Uh, improved defenses in Melilla. Have a star for it. Sure. Whatever. Let's do it. It, it is costing us, uh, some stuff. But, uh, but I think that's fine. Buildings. Star for it. Boom. There you go. Okay. Let's go back to our hotkey place. Can you go over here? Yeah, let's go over here. See what that is. And after this, he should probably start heading home, maybe? Oh, there's Tortuga. Intriguing. I don't know. Maybe maybe at like 50% he should head home? I don't know how long it takes to get places. But we're finding things, so that's good, at least. I suppose. Finding the new world. Arguing. Yeah, whatever. Oh, I can convert my religion? Oh, I can convert my provinces to religion. Well, I mean, I guess we might as well here, because it seems like this one will do it. So, I mean, we don't really have the money. And do I care? I kind of would prefer, because like once you get below 50% religious unity, I think there's an event that makes it so that you convert. And it might not be the worst idea to convert. Maybe not. You know? Might not be the worst idea. Um, positive stability, provincial taxes. So that's 2.5. We have 2.5.1. So it would take a long time. 
And it, it's it's not the, I don't know. I don't think it's worth the money right now. Plus, I mean, like, we're not going to always be animist, you know what I mean? Like, eventually, that shit's gonna have to be not the case. Um, and now, we can actually think about going into the new world, you know? And start colonizing, uh, colonizing good old, uh, America town. Which, you know, is probably not the worst idea. Actually, you should come over here first, and then go back home. Go repair. Owalu Suleiman, he is a great man. He's a wonderful man. His uh, exploration efforts have been amazing. He's head ho headed home now. And uh, we are losing some things. National decisions available. Oh, hey, hey, we have a new thing. Anti-Piracy Act. Oversea ever six extension is less than 2%. Good, at peace. And uh, we just get better relations over time. Fuck yeah, yeah, pass that, sure. Why not? Tangiers, 127? Okay, how much would sending a gift do for you? I guess we can't, because our, our diplomats are doing things. So if I could, I guess I'll just get them to improve relations to full. These guys are repairing. Does it tell you how long it takes to repair? I wish it did. Uh, maintenance, 0.9 ducats a month. Intriguing. Army maintenance still a lot. More than our colonies. Oh, alright. Well, Kalabi Fatim died, which, you know, is a bad thing, but it's also kind of a good thing. I just wanted him to die a natural death. I didn't want to I didn't want to fire him before the end, you know? Uh what's our force limit? Okay, so once we finish annexing this, we're gonna have we're gonna be over our force limit probably. Um here's another thing. Okay, trade depot. Trade value power plus 25%. Why can't we build it there? Uh, oh, farm estate is being built. Okay, so that's that's why. Why? How long is that taking? Oh, it's at 26%. Alright, so once the farm estate's done there, we're going to get um, more production out of the grain. The question is, like, do we want more production out of, the, out of, like, ivory and stuff? I don't know. I don't know. We got more grain though, so you know that's cool. Also, does the do the goods change over time? They might. They might. Could be wrong, but they might do that. And how close are we on this technology? Ooh, we're real close. We're real close. I like being real close. Feels good. Feels real good. All right. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Could probably go up to four speed. Wow. Wait. Hold on. You're. Oh, you're not done yet. Okay. Yeah, let's go up to four speed then. Whatever. Hey, we gained five army tradition. Okay, mission selected. Fortifies us how? I mean, you know, this, this probably isn't the worst thing in the world. Doing these missions. Zazo. Where is this? Okay. Sure. Here. We are using military power by doing this, but now that our, our leader's dead, you know, it's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, so we're good now on this guy. So you can come up over, I don't know, over here? Yeah, do it. Let's get him out. Get Uwali Suleiman up to, up to snuff. Colonies are doing work. 212 there, 220 there good once one of those colonies is done we can start a new one oh whoa 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 who's this a mayan fleet oh snap so did we just we just met the mayans uh oh spaghettio and the aztecs would you look at that holy cow hey look it's the mayans crazy Whoa. We found some goodness, friends. Um. Okay. Oh, you gotta get home. Oh, no, no. Okay. Get back. Get back home, buddy. Okay, so what are the complaints about Bailiff? Uh-oh. 
A bailiff from one of our provinces has earned the reputation of being a greedy and cruel person. The local populace have gathered a petition to have him removed. We can execute him and lose 33 prestige, which does not seem good. Or lose the stability. So we're going to lose the prestige because we have, uh, you know, we had a lot. Executing him didn't really do much for us. I hope that we're going to be okay here with this guy. We might not. Owali Suleiman, I believe in you. He might have done too much. Oh, he's got to get back home. He's got to get back home. He did it. Oh, what a master of disaster. A master of greatness. Okay, so who? where do we fortify now? Improved defenses in Mercia. Have a star for it. Yes. Okay, that's the one that I was actually looking for because that one will be a good time. Um, so new national decisions. I'm just going to set that one to off. Um... All right, cool. I, you know, I think that's probably a good place to end it uh, for right now. We, we, we're building a star fort in Mercia. Basically, we're doing some administrative stuff. You know, we're 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 setting up all our all our goodness. We're 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 almost done getting all of our land connected, and then we could start colonizing down here in Africa. Uh, maybe we should start in the New World, get some tariffs going. I don't know. I don't know what's the best idea. Um, it might be good to to do it to get some dudes over and uh, start the colonization process. I'm not really sure. Can we colonize out here? Do we have enough trade range? Uh, yeah, actually. Okay. So that's as far as we can go. It's right there. Nice. So we could get over here, which is in what trade node? That's in the Caribbean trade node. Oh man, and Panama trade node is glorious. But unfortunately, we don't have the range for that. Now I wonder... Right, we can increase our colonists to another value, which might be good. Getting another colonist might not be the worst idea. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so, uh, you know, a lot of, lot of things. A lot of, lot of stuff that we can consider here. Uh, for the future. So, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. This has been EU4. We're going to be back with more soon. Look at our glorious kingdom. Our glorious kingdom, soon to be empire. You know, we got to be one of the biggest in the world right now. I mean, obviously, we're number 21, which kind of sucks because our ranks aren't that high. How's France doing on tech? Oh, wow, they're at 11, 11, and 9, and we are at. Okay, so 1, uh, 3. One, three, and what was it? Uh, wait, hold on. God damn it! Get, get, get to our tech. Where's our tech? Okay, so nine, eleven, eleven, versus seven, eight, nine. So uh, two, uh, three. Okay, so that's five. That's six. We're pretty close. We are pretty close, actually. And uh, I forgot where I I know where it is. I think it's it's on it's on technology. Yeah, westernized. Okay. So, they're only six tech ahead of us. It would reduce our stability by three and change our technology group to Western. It would then slowly Westernize and our progress will depend on our monarch power each month up to ten. So, we want to get our monarch power up to the highest possible values before we do it. We need to get them ahead of us quite a bit. And then, uh, and then, and then we'll be good to go. Um, naval morale. Uh, the colonial range plus 50... It's not percent. Okay. Intriguing. So I didn't actually realize France got so far ahead. Ooh. Oh, they're rivals of us. Ay, ay, ay. That is not something that I like to see one bit. Just not even a single bit do I like that, that we're rivaled with them. So uh, we have a couple things we got to do. We got we to gotta increase stability at least up to three before we do. We got a lot of things. We got a lot of things before we get the westernization process underhand. Anyway, uh, that's the end of the uh, EU4 episode. Sorry that the end took so long. I love you all, you beautiful people. Wally Suleiman, greatest, greatest leader the world's ever known. Uh, we will be back soon. I love you all, you beautiful people. Have a good night. And this is Alpaca Patrol signing out. Peace, fools.